Morning, guys, anyway. <laughs> Trying to get about with my seatbelt, aren't I? Uh, I've got loads to do today. I've got a, uh, a van that's broke down. One of my mates' his van's broke down, Mark. He's the one that has the crane game. He has uh, steel erectors on this. He has a steel erecting gang, but his van won't start. It's just going not starting off. I'll just get some WD for this. And I've got our Scotty. Uh, he's got a breakdown. Oh, it's right the way down there, man, isn't it? I'll smell nice of WD anyway, won't I? You can't really get in without taking that panel off. Yeah, so I'm going to go to Mark's now. I'm going to have a look at his van, see why that ain't started, and then go to Scotty's. <sighs> Fucking. That's the plan, anyway. Let's go. Oh, my box. Fuck it. Leave it open. Not be asked. Okay, now you're all kids out in there, Mark, ain't you? What is this why you want it started, Mark? Yes, <laughs> it's an emergency, it's a fishing emergency. That is good, that is. You've kicked that out well in there, ain't you? you? rubbed it all this up. Bloody yeah, hell, it's smart, isn't it? This yeah, because this was your work van, wasn't it? I had this since brand new 2012, and it, it got to the point where I was going to scrap it, it was that trash. And now you've done it all so up then? Rob just said two grand, give it a bit of paint, one. did it all inside out, tied it up. Chubs are good, him. Ah, I've got the isolator key there, I see. Which you've got one new and on it now, ain't you? Yeah, well, when's the last time you ran this, Mark? Um, well, Is it? So it's been stood a good bit then. Yesterday, it literally ran for about five, ten seconds and then just put out. Is it? Amazing tub it. Go on, Mark, try. Uh, just pop the bite up, Mark. Yeah, try it. Yeah, turn it on, Mark. Let's have a listen to this beast. Oh, right there, Mark. Right, is it getting fuel up? That's the first question. You got fuel in, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I know it sounds a silly question, but. Do you remember that crane I went out to you with? What, and then the fuel it? Oh, yeah. Um, I went out fucking an hour away to Mel, wherever it was. Yeah, yeah something like that. It was at, it was at uh, that Prince's. Yeah, I'm down there 17, wasn't it? Yeah, I went out to Mark, one of his cranes wouldn't start. I went out to him, I was there fucking round, or oh, I was there for a good hour, trying to get all the fuel up in the end, and they fueled in the tank. <laughs> That's that, same, that's that same fuel gauge still doesn't work now. <laughs> <laughs> and I like it because the, uh, the crane driver said, oh yeah, the fuel gauge, that don't work like that. So you can't go off what the fuel gauge says. It's like, oh right. Because the fuel gauge said halfway to there. <laughs> Classic. Right, I'm just going to check, Mark, see if you've got actually fuel going into this filter. Because this should have an electric pump on it somewhere, shouldn't it? No, I'm not, I don't know so. nothing about engines, do I? You'd have thought this would have a fucking a fuel pump in the tank or something. Right, I'm just going to turn my Mark and do that. Right, I've got them two parts. Yeah, just put your ignition on, Mark. See whether this this is actually pumping out. Yeah, off. Yeah, it's coming out. So the fuel pump's working. So it's getting up to the filter anyway. I better see if it's coming out of the filter, haven't I? Yeah, put your ignition on again then, Mark. Right? See if it's coming out of the filter. Yep. Took a bit of time though to come out for some reason. What if it's got airlock in it? Put it on again. Yep. Right, leave the ignition on, Mark. Just thinking whether the fuel's run back, you know, because it's been stood so long. Try and turn her over, Mark. Yep, that's what it was. Oh, did you stop that? 
Did you stop it? Stop on its own? Yeah, try it again. Plus this ain't on, I swear. There, no, it's all right now. <laughs> what have you done to it? Anything, just... Nothing, just took the fuel pipes out. I reckon the fuel's drained back, you know, because you haven't it started so long. Yeah. I reckon the fuel's drained back out of the filter and it's... Oh, okay. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, I've not started this year anyway. I tried to start in January, but... Right, so. Yeah. I am wondering what this sensor does. Anyone, what's that sensor do there, look? On the comments, please. My brain of information, the comments. <laughs> Isn't it? Oh, is it engine management? Oh. I don't know if that was on well, we'll plug that in and see whether it goes out. Well, just switch it off again and switch it on and see if it goes out. Got a nice bit of silicon in there. Ah, somebody's been with the silicon around here, haven't they? Oh, that's glue gun. Yeah, striker up again. Oh, she's a minter, Mark. Is the engine management light still on? That's the RV co-sign normally. Yeah, that's the RV co-sign. Must have turned into an RV <laughs> <laughs> That's an explanation. That'll be alright, don't know. We like a bit of colours on the dash. He's only using this as a glamping, as a glamping tool, isn't it, Mark? Hey? When are you next going fishing? Weekend? Uh, Friday, yeah. Friday! Oh no, it's not Friday now. Look, I haven't even opened my new jack. Look, I've got a brand new jack in there. Fucking hell. Posh, innit? Right, Mark, say bye to everyone on here, look. Bye. bye look, there's Mark, by the way. My old friend Mark. I was a kid when he held me over the pond and he pretended to drop me in the pond and my tooth hit the side of the slab and it bent my tooth back. And then luckily, about two years ago, I got hit in the face and they bent the other tooth back so it straightened it up. <laughs> <laughs> so it fixed itself. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How am I more drunk? Cheers, hello, thank you. How am I more drunk, you don't say? Oh, you smashed that because it's too full. <laughs> hey. 38 years ago. Yeah, it did 38 yeah, years ago. And look, you know, air gun safety, look. When Mark was a kid, show your hand, Mark. You see that there, look? It was going through the swamp, that's at the back of our field, uh, with a brake barrel air gun, weren't you, Mark? Yeah. And the fucking, it was holding it like that, and the trigger went all, went off, didn't yeah, it? It just, it just sprung up. Yeah, it just cocked up, ripped and then off. fucking ripped. And how old was you, Mark? You weren't very old, was you? Yeah. 14, yeah, and it ripped his fucking hand apart there, look. That, that was hanging down there, like that. Ooh, oh, the injuries we go yeah, through. Yeah. That's air gun safety for you, you see. Look at this, though, what Mark's got in his fucking ass. It's, what, it's samurai training gear? Yeah, samurai training on for the pension period. It's about over 200 years old. Is it? Unbelievable! In your house, you should have things what you like. Not yeah. Look in a magazine and go for oh, mirror yeah. furniture and sparkly vases and stuff. That's cushy, that is. That mean things to me. Yeah, that mean things to me. Yeah. Not a lot. That's the destroyer that my granddad got in the Second World War. Oh, is it? HMS Karen. Oh, what, what did he do on that, Mark? He was uh, worked in the engine room. I don't know if it was on that ship or another one, but he got a torpedo. Oh, did they? I asked him one day, he never, told, he never, never told talked about it. Never talked about it, no. But one day, he just, while I went around, he just started talking about it. Tears was flowing. Oh, what was it? Yeah. So he got torpedoed, and uh, I said, where did you work? And so in the engine room, I said, where did you get torpedoed in, uh, in the engine room? Oh, fucking hell. He said, obviously, when they slammed the flood doors, he was the last one through, stuck his leg out, slammed it, broke his ankle, that opened the door, get pulled, out. pulled him through. Or someone got out, were they? And I said, oh, was people trapped inside? And he said, yeah, but uh, some would say, it was a good thing because they were so badly injured. Fucking hell. Yeah. And was that the actual boat then? I don't, oh, that's I, don't, one I don't think it was that, that one, one that got sank. No. But that's one of the ones that it's It was that's, on. That's HMS Karen in, in the 1944. That picture was in his house, but obviously when he died. Oh, yeah, you so inherited got, the like, picture. Medals and some photos. Oh, has he got medals and all yeah. from World War II? His medals are in the safe, and I've got um, photos of it in there. Mark's a shooting man, ain't you, Mark? Yeah. Jesus, Mark, this is nice. Mark's selling this ass and all. I'm going to show you and all. You know on my channel, because he's always wanted a fishing lake. That's Mark's dream, even as a kid, wasn't it, Mark? Yeah. He always dreamt of having his own fishing lake. So he's, he's finally sourced one now, hopefully. Yeah. So 
I'll do a recording of it at a future date when he finally gets it. Because then he's got a, he's bought a, a, an ass that's a bit run down, but it's got land to it. And then, what's he got? Two fishing lakes on it. Yeah. Two fishing lakes. So obviously he needs to, he's, he's downsizing as such, but yeah, he's upsizing his land, isn't it, Mark? Uh, yeah. Just in case you can't be asked to get out. To get, <laughs> get, out, get out of your DA. Are you religious, Mark? No, but that's one of the, like, the great side things of having an island. You've been to island before. No, every, never been, no. My brother lives there, but every so often they have like, I don't know what they're called, like little like shrine things on the side of the road. Oh, yeah. That's and that's one of them. One of the little things what have written. They must have got to start getting in there. It's like an old school thing, isn't it? Oh, that's interesting, though, isn't it? Anyone painted this that you know, Mark? No, it's awesome. no Just bought it. My daughter likes Oh, yeah, she likes horses, don't she? Fucking hell, Mark, this is posh in here, isn't it? What the frick? Is that a real crocodilian? It was. Oh, it was. See oh, my God. Oh, is that where it got shot? Yeah. Oh my god, no. I shot that just before I trapped my hand in the air rifle. <laughs> <laughs> that, that was from the swamp. <laughs> <laughs> Dangerous ass swamp is, you know. Look at your end marks. I thought enough if I knew he was going to come around and stop me. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't know he was going to come and do a tour of my house. I even thought you'd fix him in transit, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey? And the hell. What's, is that a leopard? Yeah. Bronze oh, bronze. I think probably the 60s, I reckon. That's good, isn't it? I did have. I saw that in an antique shop window and knew it. I drove past it with my ex girlfriend. What sort? And I went, oh, I like left it there. About a week later, I thought, what's this? All wrapped up. Full, oh, did full she full buy it? Yeah. Oh, that was I mean, nice. Christmas wasn't it? Or my birthday or something. I can't remember what. Oh, that was nice, wasn't it? Yeah. Cup of tea time then, Mark. Bloody hell, she's nice in here, Mark, isn't it? Yeah, it's, uh, hang on. If anybody wants to buy this house, it's up for sale, isn't it, Mark? <laughs> <laughs> Chris's house tours. Oh, is that him? That's the uh, oh. thing off his... Oh, yeah. yeah. That's Look how young, time. Lord. Yeah. How old was he then? Well, he lied, you know? lied about his age, as many of them did. Oh, did he? Yeah, that was the 22nd of May, 1944, that was taken. Oh, my God, like, just kids, aren't they? Yeah. Hey? Yeah. What, he lied about his age to get in? Yeah. I don't know how old it was, but... Obviously, yeah, it, was, yeah. it was too young. Oh, down his face, like, for his whole life. My grandma and dad did. What's that from that? But when I asked him, because when he was a kid, you think, oh, like, yeah, I know, what's that? Done it. You yeah. But when I, asked, when, I, when I asked him, he was like, no, well, I got into a fight on the ship with another oh, sailor. Oh, what, with another sailor? <laughs> what, and slashed him? Slashed him down the face, yeah. That's on the show. <laughs> yeah, because you're thinking, oh, he must have had a yeah, yeah. combat here. Yeah, yeah, I want to know the... Yeah, I was thinking, like, what you know, when you're a little kid, you think, oh, I must have been the German. <laughs> yeah, it was in yeah, the German yeah, type, Gary. And then eventually asked him, this, this is like a little curiosity. What says your curiosity, curiosity company? Yeah. <laughs> <Hey. laughs> this as well, I'm talking about all my little shit, bits of shit here, like, but. <laughs> it's interesting, though, I like bits of shit. It's a Newark, Newark on Trent, Devon Brewery bottle. Oh, right. Found that. You know, you the Council Officers in Newark. Yeah. When we was doing, putting that up, steel up on that. Somebody dug oh, up. Oh, when you was doing the job there? Yeah, when we was putting the steel up on there. Someone dug up and there was a big pile of these bottles, so I took one. So you took one, yeah. It's about mean so much, though, doesn't it? Hey? Bit of history there, you see. You find stuff on these jobs, don't you? I, I always find stuff. Much. I go around, but I collect up that much crap. I really do. This house is massive, Mark, isn't it? Hey? Freaking hell. Do you still shoot, Mark? Do you still yeah, do you shoot it? Yeah. Oh, there's your grandpa par again, look there. Yeah, that's the, the copy of that original photo I just showed you. Who's that above it? That's me. Oh, is that you? Yeah. You look a bit slim then, Mark. I probably was. <laughs> oh, <laughs> hey. <laughs> it's still got a dog, Mark, now. Yeah, she's got one over, but I don't know what it was now. Three or four years ago. Oh, I see. Something like that, yeah. I don't like the head, Mark, can't I? Yeah. That's, uh, is this a working... It's marble, that is. Oh, yeah, it's a working fireplace. Is it marble, is it? Probably marble. Bloody yeah. hell. Oh, the What's that, another antique <clears> thing? <throat> is that another antique? Bye. No, I like a city. Yeah, you just like to, yeah, like you see it. so much you like it. Quiet, house, yeah, but you're not surrounded by junk though, are you? You know what I mean? You know, like some people are like, oh, I like that, I like that. I think if you buy the modern fashionable things, like ornaments and stuff, in five, ten years, you're going to skip. Yeah, they're chucking the skip, yeah. yeah you don't have stuff like, like stuff like that, obviously. Yeah. It's not much right. Yeah. It's still going to be worth it. It means so much, doesn't it? You're probably appreciating value over time. Yeah. This is a, well, it's very distinctive. Everybody will know what it is. It's a Royal Marines Commando Dagger which I'm pretty sure they still use the same ones today. But this one's from the Second World War. Oh, is it? There's various types of 
handles what, what they get with, with made by different factories, but essentially they are the same. So that's just one of the little things that you pick up a car. Yeah, like you pick sale. up, yeah. I've probably had 25 years, and that's it. Yeah, I, just I think, know, oh, yeah. I like that. It's not, it's not new. It's How long have you had that for? 25 years. Well, you've had it 25 oh, like years. 25 years, yeah. I bought that from a car boot sale when I was about 20, maybe, something like that. We like it all. And a quid for coffee tea. <laughs> right, I'm good. Yeah, quick foot, Chris. Thank you, Mark. Mark. All right. Bye-bye. And uh, you're warm to the crane as well. You haven't sent me that how much that one is yet either. He's oh. doing that tyre right now, actually. Oh, I need my jack yeah, from there, I know. He's doing that tyre. He's probably done it now. He's doing it this morning. Yeah, because I can get my jack then. See you in a bit. Right, I'm at way to Scotty's now. I'm a bit behind. It's 12 o'clock already. I've been talking to Mark for fucking about an hour and a half. <laughs> you know what I'm like with me talking? Right, Scotty's Yard. Let's go. I had to get to McDonald's on my travels, didn't I? Josh has just wrote me. He said, where are you? He said, on the way to Scotty's. He said, he gone past Norrell yet? I said, no. He said, just... Uh, just come into Norrell, I've uh, gears a jump start with my van, it's dead. So he's lucky because I'm right near it now. So that's a good call out service, isn't it, Mia? Brian Johnson's. <laughs> he's in a right predicament here, isn't he? What's up here, buddy? Flat back tray? Hey, I've got just the thing for jumping flat batteries. Top Hi, done. Man. You see it, Joe? Good jumper, isn't it? Right. When you leave your son, mate, in the van, looking after the dog, there's a radio on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, quick though, wasn't it? Look how quick I was. Brilliant. Lot service lot, you see? Ten minutes. Ten minutes that was, I got, got here, didn't I? Fuck yeah, I've got a time machine, I have, Joe, haven't I? Right, let's get my top dog machine out, Josh. Look, here it is, fully charged. Do you know how long it took us to get here? Yeah. Seven minutes. Fucking seven minutes. Now that is some <laughs> good going, isn't it? How does that work, though, when we're 15 minutes out of the way? I know, exactly. Time machine. One, Hello, boy. I said, Joe, one man you can't fall out with, you know, is our Chris. Why? Why? Because it's too handy. It's too fucking handy, <laughs> isn't it? <What laughs> fucking legend. Joe's going to come and work for me anyway, ain't you, Joe? Yes. Joe's going to be a mechanic, ain't he? Right, right then, buddy, this is my, my dad, machine. My dad's rang me up. He's been uh, we're flat out. Oh, is Ooh, he? Uh, we need to catch up with these job. You Where saying? are you? Um, uh. <laughs> in the van and the battery's flat. 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 You must have left some... No, I don't think he did. I left the light on thing. No, 100% fully charged. Did it How long will this take, then? What? Well, the jump? Straight away. Instant, buddy, with my machine, we're top dog, you know. No, it says when it goes green, Chris, remember? That's it, when Joe knows, doesn't he? Good job he fucking looks at my channel. He'll know everything, he will. No, right, look, like you plug it, it look, it's on green. Yeah, it is. They're not back yet. Oh, no, no. Oh, try it then. You're on permanent green light. Just put in green. Oh, wow. oh yeah. you yeah. see what I'm doing? It's top dog. Get one, bro, lads. <laughs> top dog. Top Don, I want the 24 volt version, please. 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 <laughs> Look good though, isn't it? Please, that little box. Please, we're struggling this 12 volt. Look, look at this. fucking amazing. Look at that. Took it down one bar, that. But this, okay? Yeah, well, that was quick though, wasn't it? And it charges your phone up and all, but it is. Every mechanic needs one. They do though, How don't they? they? Every single one. I think they're only cheap, Mosh. How much? Eight odd quid, I think I looked on Amazon. Well, I'll tell you why, because they'll be handy for our night fishing. Yeah, you've got your power pack in here, look and all. You've got your hand, oh, and you've got a torch and all. What? I've never torch had the torch for I never thought it'd be that good to tell you the truth, but it is. It we like that. We like Top Dog. <laughs> free bed, another free bed. And it did that too. <laughs> it was too easy, easy wasn't it? Hour, That's yeah. the trouble. You know when you get the job done too easy, lot? Like, it's just too easy, isn't it? Just for their Chris, right. just say, I've lost my 12 volt. Uh, this thing, 12 volt, can you give me a 24 volt one? Yeah, I've lost my 12 volt one. What are you going to? <laughs> Break that. On summit. Guys, what a fucking legend. Never <laughs> fall out with this one. Bloody top man. <laughs> right, carry on then. Boy, what have you done here? Drain or something? Blasted. Oh, is this the place where you're blasted? We're there. Uh... Catch you later, buddy. 
We'll have a beer tonight then, mate. What, celebrate? To celebrate the jump start? Yeah, celebrate the top You bring the beers then, buddy! Yeah! yeah. Again, again, Josh. And even our battery starts. Right, Scotty's yard, let's go. You haven't got an iPhone charge cable, have you? iPhone, no chance. Oh, I've got Great answer behind you, know. <laughs> oh, you got an iPhone? And Joey got one? <laughs> Fucking hell. I've oh, got that garage, runner. Oh, fucking hell. Our ladies took me in charge around my van lot and not returned it. And now I'm stuck here on low battery with no charger. Bloody kids again. You can't have out when you're a parent. You really can't. Take care of yourself. Yeah, you Fucking hell. Just going through here, through Norrell. Jack's flagged me down. That's uh, one of my mates who's a mobile mechanic. That's his wife. Another lad. That's a mobile mechanic, there's hydraulic hoses and that. Yesterday morning, uh, he fucking had a brain hemorrhage or something. So he was at work yesterday morning, Dave spoke to him, he was at work, on the way to his job, and he slumped over in his steering wheel, on his own, had a brain hemorrhage. And uh, she's just flagged me down and said he's just this minute passed away at hospital. This fucking belt, look at it. Fuck that. Hey, and that's it, he's gone now. Fucking hell. Yesterday morning, it was fine. And now, uh, fucking, what you say, brain hemorrhage, bleeding on the brain or something, and now it's not with us anymore. It's gone. Fucking scary, innit? Hey. Fucking hell. It's unreal, innit? Hey? You can fucking be here one minute and gone. Poor cunt was working yesterday morning out in his van. Look at this charger. Oh. What I mean, fucking hell, fine. Oh, dear, I can't believe it. <sighs> right, let's get to Scotty's, and I've been, I've been going there all fucking morning. I still haven't got there. Jesus, I've, I've been doing everything else but, haven't I? Oh, dear. <laughs> really deflates you, that does, doesn't it? <sighs> fucking seems unreal, that does. <laughs> Scott's not here like, I've uh, yeah, I just told Scott about it because Scott knew him and all. He says, oh, well, he says, that's all I'm here, fucking death all the time. I said, I know the feeling, that's all I told him all. Funerals, fucking deaths, Jesus. Oof. Right, I don't know what I've got to do here even. It's not about some kind of hydraulic leak or something. I don't really know, I have to go and see the lads. I think it might be on the brake. William Wallace just says, this compressor is pissing out oil through the pipe or something. What's it mean, through there? What's that about? What am I gonna do with compressor with no wheels? What's up with this? It's blowing oil out there. Oil's coming from every corner. What, they are, they are, they are. Oh, is it? What's what, it come out that bad? Oh, you turn it on, Tom. It's always trickled out a bit, but... Well, right away, right then, then. Yeah, yeah. You know, you know, once it starts getting really hot, yeah. there's always been a little, little stick of water come out of it, a royal come out every now and again. Ah, you're fine. Mitchell point is somewhere. Point that somewhere. See, you put the pop royal in it. Oh no, you should have seen it yet overnight. Oh, fucking bollocks. It was like a fucking bollocks. Who's going to have a full puddle on floor? Hey, top two oil then, Rob. Hey. He had to top this up. Oh, well, he filled it up. It's, it's, it's how much oil he's blew out. But it was working perfect. Oh, that goes into this bit, doesn't it? This What's fucking this thing here. Because this has got some Yeah, that's in the it. reservoir lot. Yeah. That's the oil for the. Right, I've just had a Google of this because I don't know, I'm not familiar with these compressors, am I? Apparently, 
the main causes of oil coming out of there is there's a separator filter that can get bunged up. That's what separates the oil uh, and the air. So the oil doesn't contaminate the air. If that filter is bunged up, it can cause it. And the pipe going from the bottom of the filter, the outlet pipe, if that's bunged up, it can cause it. Or if you've got the wrong oil in here, that can cause it. Uh, and I've only just scratched the surface, so I need to find this oil separator filter, really. Whatever that is. What's that? That goes into the, the pump down there. Well, there's the feed pipe, not there. That's the feed pipe. And that goes in the top of that tank. Fucking William Wallace. What's in here, I wonder? I've always wanted to know what's in here, you know. What is in there? What's in there? I know there's oil in it, obviously, at the bottom, but what's in the top of it? I might have an investigation of that. Well, do you know what's in there? Showing them off the fashion budget. What, what's in there, do you know? I don't know, like, No, I don't either. Shall we take it apart? Well, not we. Shall I take it apart, William? I'm touching it. You break your bite, don't you, son? Ah! Uh, they reckon if you topped up with too much oil, it can piss out that pot. What oil to put in it? Do you know? Because that's another thing. If it, it depends what oil's in it. It's meant to have proper compressor oil in it, isn't it? Woo -hoo! Right, we'll just go take our top off. See what's in there. I'll, I'll pull the struggle bus up. Good old struggle bus. The good old bus. Bloody good bus. William Wallace. <laughs> First, I'm going to take the rams off this so I can pour it all the way back. Look at that now. No tool is ever too big. This might be a bit big. <laughs> As I suspected, there's a filter in here. Ah, oh, the gasket's built into the filter, though. That's a bit special, isn't it? Ale, Ale, dig a diaries. Come on, I need you, buddy. Uh, I've asked him before about these little compressors. He says he's had no to do with him, so our alley can't help us, unfortunately. Yeah, look, it's pissed right through inside. The filter's fucked, isn't it? Yeah, I'll get a new filter. Filter's fucked. Yeah, I've just ran up parting about that filter. Thermos says it looks like a big top hat. Is that right? I said, yeah, that's it. That's it, Thermos. I reckon that's what's up with that, Will. That filter, no, not that filter. That filter in there. Oh, what's up with you then, Will, then? Snap. I never looked at me that, Will. Why are you clean, Rob? Where's Rob, look? You've never seen him live before, guys, have you? Got an appointment. Hey, Buzzy Bumblebee. Is that positive or negative, that one? Negative. Oh, damn it. Got that, Will. Look at that. Oh, yeah, yeah, look at that. I've had to sacrifice my tools for that. Right, there's not a lot I can do with this, then, is there, until tomorrow? Thermos is getting me a filter, but it won't be here until tomorrow. He thinks it's the right one anyway. So we'll, uh, well, we'll have to wait, won't we? <laughs> Basically, we'll, uh, we'll have to wait, obviously. Because I can't produce filters out of my arse, unfortunately. I may as well get what I am looking all, Anna, while I'm at the job. Right, you press it. Should be pissing out here then, shouldn't it? Got water in it, hasn't it? No. 
Oh, is it not? That is dirty as fuck. What's this here? Oh, that's something else, that is. I think that's like soap water. Oh, yeah. Well, we've got no water in that. Well, we best put some water in it, don't we? How can we get this out? Forklift it. Fucking hell. So, welcome to the fucking vortex. Welcome to the place. Come off again. And it leaks this one. You'll be able to do over that. Obviously, that just goes in there. Why well, don't we just put that direct there? I don't know if it'll fit, that. Is it too small, that, do you reckon? Yeah. Are you about to do that yet? Yeah, I'll do it now. The vortex yard. I was hoping to piss off, really. <laughs> well, it's got to do I could do with that steam cleaning going. What well, I've been running in ages, it's just been chucked there. Now our William Wallace has come up with these problems. They're fucking problems all the time, and here. Welcome to the vortex. Not the best, is it? Hello! Hello? Anybody there? Well, I must get this end off. It's all perished, isn't it? It's all perished! It's all perished. It's all perished. It's all perished. Now I've got to try and fit that on the rubber bit. Oh, easy. Day problem solved, boat two. Another little job done. Fuck it now, look at all that in there. That's no good, is it? Fucking filthy that is, man. Fuck it, that won't pump it through, will it? That filter will be chocker, won't it? Well, what I'm going to have to do before I even start is this tank wants taking off, really. There and there, tip them straps off, forklift that tank up and tipped upside down to tip all the crap out, don't it? Because we're pissed in the wind from the get-go, aren't we? Uh, undo these pipes here, I'm going to do then. I'll, I'll undo them, I'll leave this off and then the lads will have to clean this out when they get time because I've got to go soon, so I, I, can't, I can't get in the vortex for too long. Right, that's it, everything's disconnected now. So the lads can lift this tank off, turn it upside down, clear it out, uh, and I've got to be back tomorrow to fit that filter and obviously try to route this. And Dave's just rang me up, D&J. Uh, he's got his telehandler, that's broke down. It's got oil leaks, so that's stuck in the middle of the yard. Which I was going to go there tomorrow anyway. So uh, I've got this to do, that to do. Fuck it, I was hoping to go home, you know, and start this. I've got this and pads to do on a wheeler, but time, I didn't realise the time, you know, time's ticking. Uh, so, yeah, we'll leave that for tomorrow, won't we? Hey, I've had a parcel come through the post, all, all the way from Aussieland. Uh, it's from Chris Connolly. Uh, this is for the struggle bus. Look. Gosh, day. That's a temporary tyre repair. You drill a hole, push these through, pull them out, and it's a temporary repair. Lasts forever. Thank you, Chris. And he sent me some money because he wants sending a, uh, a mug. So I'll get Luke on that. I will, Chris. I'll get him to send you it. I'll have to put him somewhere, Chris. Lovely, that is. My little Aussie dog, isn't it? I need to find a space for him. Aha! Uh -huh. Look at that. Little dog there, look. Aussie dog there, isn't it? I'll put that note with the rest of my notes in my little collection. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah, and I'll get Luke to send you that, Chris. Thank you very much, mate. I don't know how long it'll take to get there, like, to Australia, I'm sure, but I'll get, I'll, I'll get him on it. I'll send him your address. Look, we're leaving our William oh, now, aren't we, Will? See that fur man shape? Oh, oh man the man's hand shape, man William! Uh, right, guys, that might be it. So I'll catch you on the next one. Woo! -hoo! See you later, alligators. In a while, crocodile. See you later.